Forkfest.party It's gonna be a party Cherished allies For you are cherished I speak to you from New Hampshire A most unpeopled outpost of the Empire This Christmas In the year of our Lord 2018 The words peace and liberty often do seem to be little more than that pronouncements slogans and yet we stand at a moment of both great hope and great peril not merely the latter across the wavering conglomerate of mid-sized states ruled from the district of Columbia a violent even physical division has occurred perhaps driven deeper than any since the great conflict ascended north from south in this breach this trench fueled by the most odious pronouncements by a most tyrannical executive set forth the potential for conflict of a most odious kind awaiting perhaps only the spark of an economic debacle of a type well known in Keynesian commercial circles or the cruel machinations of an intelligence apparatus whose peeping tomery wrinkles unsurpassed in the long lamentable catalogue of human crime these perils stand against a backdrop of positive change remarkable remarkably brought forth by the very unflattering personality of the Empire's authoritarian executive this president eclipsing all who had come before in manic depravity nevertheless has sprung forth a disruption of great potential benefit that of sudden peace returning or endeavoring to return American centurions from their cruelly misapplied disbursements in doing so this unsavory head of state undertakes the most unpardonable breach in the minds of the security bureaucracies that envision themselves the true rulers of America or it is intelligence and security communities which remain ensconced in power in nations from generation to generation and form of government to form of government fitted and succored by the comparable comparably immovable cartel of military industry will these institutions of perpetual slaughter and their intelligence community allies remain quiescent in this most or in the face of this most unacceptable eventuality that of peace what horrors what tragedies would they be willing to inflict upon an innocent humanity to prevent it or what might they be willing to unleash upon the much less innocent president with the orange hair we may never know the precise schemings of these shadow potentates only that they occur and are occurring it is incumbent upon us as people as the people not to allow ourselves to become manipulated 
into conflict with one another. Objects under the control, knowing or otherwise, of hidden puppeteers. It is incumbent among us, upon us, to support our neighbors, regardless of their beliefs or ours, and to be provisioned with many uh, kilograms of sustenance, should the direst machinations of our unseen overlords be brought in their desperation to fruition. For my part, I can also recommend and welcome you to a relatively safe nation-state, as yet unborn in its full form, that of the modest but prosperous region of New Hampshire. Here, those of you who adhere not to the bloviating present White House, nor the randomly vandalistic shock troops of the left wing, here in New Hampshire you may find the very third path the late Dr. Krauthammer espoused before his death, the one of tolerance and fiscal restraint personified in its purest form by the five thousand ardent migrants of the Free State Project. This endeavor, articulated at freestateproject.org, offers an imperfect but functional alternative to the twin dead-end streets of right and left of party somewhat and party somewhat less sometimes. A third side of the coin, facing in an entirely new direction, that of liberty. In these potentially hazardous moments, and perhaps years, be a friend of your enemy. Be prepared to succor your neighbors, and be here in the free state. You've probably heard of Porkfest, but have you heard of Forkfest? It's a decentralized alternative. It's also at Rogers Campground at a slightly different time. You don't even need a ticket. Visit Forkfest.party. It's gonna be a party.